What's going on guys? I'm actually doing this on time. On Thursday, just got back from getting my books. Last week I said it, I'm even more Beardy McBeard this time. A little quick fact before we start, I'm taking a look. Interestingly enough, my videos without a beard have more hits than my videos with a beard. And they're all interchange. Fun fact, should I get rid of the beard? Should I not? No one knows. Anyway, the lighting, I'm like playing with this. I don't know what to do with it. I gotta stop doing these at night because I, I get the natural light works better. So the glare on these comics might be terrifying. This was a tiny week for me. I had a pitiful three comics. So, like I always have to do is I have to hurt my wallet and... Uh, I decided this was a good time to buy some issues that, uh, and some titles that I'm getting into, some back issues, and, and some further back issues as well as, uh, I had to grab one for my, my woman and I ended up getting a variant copy, uh, as well. So we'll start with this, I forgot to pick it up last week, Prelude to Infinity, number 15, Avengers, the, like I said, the glare, the lighting's horrible, so I'll try to oh, ah, close up. Oh, that's a little better. Uh, so, Prelude to Infinity, I have the other one. This is the normal Avengers title. I'm a sucker for tie-ins, so I'm trying to collect all the Infinity tie-ins. Um, so I just needed to grab that. I didn't have that yet. Uh, this is the only one I've read so far, and I love it. So glad that this... Uh, this book is now getting good. Uh, number 10, Indestructible Hulk, featuring the uh, Daredevil. This this book just went like from here all the way up to there. Like it's so good now. Uh, I love love the change, um, the team change in it. So it's it's amazing. That's all I can say. My allergies, my nose is killing me. Or it's this big scruffy mustache. I don't know. One of the two. I don't know. Then, I haven't, like I said, I haven't read any of these yet. Number four, East of West. I'm sure this is going to be good. This is one of the series I'm really, really loving. One of my favorite image series. Then we have n number 13, Superior Spider-Man. Uh, this is just a great book. It's, like, super fun. And uh, I, I have yet to have a disappointing issue. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I think the next issue is the um, the Iron Spider costume, if I believe so. I saw pictures of it. I thought it said 14. So uh, it'll be interesting to uh, see the next issue. Then uh, I basically started pulling for my... Uh, my wife, she's getting the miniseries uh, Adventure Time with the Candy Capers. Um, Pat, she really likes one of her favorite characters is Peppermint Butler. And he's like one of the uh, main people this focuses around. I had a copy of it. Um, I actually dropped it off to her at work as soon as I went to my uh, first shop to go pick up most of my pull list. And... Uh, I was at my second shop just picking up. That's where I pick up like stuff I don't pull or, or you know, titles I didn't have in my pull list that I use them because I still want to support them as well. So I found a variant cover, so I picked that up for as well. This is cover B of Adventure Time. Unfortunately, on the cover, Peppermint Butler is just uh, shadowed, so he shows up even worse in this. But that's the cover. I'll probably read this. Uh... I'm interested. I've never read any of the Adventure Time comics yet, so I'm interested to see uh, how they are. So here we go, like drum roll. Anyway, <laughs> um, I told everyone that it was looking like I was starting to get into some DC. That I I was interested in picking up a couple titles. I have done that. So I've. Uh, well, I'll do this one first because everyone knows I'm already getting this because uh, I got the first one. Uh, number two, Scott Snyder, Superman Unchained. Really liking this series, and I hate Superman. But I, I like this. Kind of reminds me kind of the Captain America series right now. Like, he's a little more darker than, than 
usual, and I love it. So the new title, I uh, I caved in. I have trust in Schneider. He's the man. So uh, I went back. I picked up number 21, Zero Year Batman. This is now added, so I'm now pulling. This is my first Batman book, so I'll have to see how I like it. And then, of course, today this came out. So, Batman number 22. Love that cover. I'm, I'm told that it's, it's an amazing, uh, amazing book. So, we'll find out. I only got one back issue of this. I'm going to pick up some more uh, during the weekend and the week. Uh, picked up number 21. Swamp Thing, the Murder Poet. I love this. Uh, I love this cover. Swamp Thing always has like the best covers. I find they uh, they really pay attention to the hard work. And he's so dark, it's hard to see. But there's that. So I'm gonna buy some more back issues of that after. And then uh, I'll have to I'll have to salute uh, Sofa King uh, Matt on this one. I am now, uh, I guess, part of the club, and I don't even got to flip it. I could just hold it like this, and you already can imagine what's there. We went number 21, Green Lantern. I'm now pulling this as well. Going to give Green Lantern a try. And then I went and pulled number 22 for Green Lantern. So, we'll see how this is and see if uh, if the DC books stay on the list. And then the I got three back issues. Um, two were a buck. One was 25 cents. I'll show the first dollar ones first. So, I got uh, the Incredible Hulk 413 back issue. The Troy Jam War, the Tro Trojan, I believe it's, uh, but they, they did a little play on words. <laughs> so, Incredible Hulk 413, and then Incredible Hulk 414, this is part 204 of the Trojan Hulk in Space. And then this might go for a favorite cover of the uh, week, number 417 of the Incredible Hulk. Please do not tell anyone the shocking secrets of the Bachelor Party. And we have all some of the main main guys at uh, at the theater, I believe it's supposed to be. They're looking at home movies. You know, you don't know what they're watching, an adult film perhaps. But you got everyone there, Captain Iron Man, Ant-Man's off in the, uh, in the, on his shoulder. Silver Sugar for Vision. Every, everybody's there, uh, hanging out, Mr. Fantastic, and of course, uh, Hulk there. So, that's all I got, uh, no statues, no nothing, uh, I had to put some money into, whoops, I had to put some money into, you know, the, uh, my man cave comic book DJ room, so, you know, I had to buy some desk stuff of that nature, so... Decided to lay, uh, lay off anything extra this week. Anyway, as always, subscribe. No, I gotta go this way. I can't go that way. Here we go. Subscribe. Like. Comment. I'm running a room. Let's go up top. And add me on Twitter. I, it's like uh, Talladega Nights. I don't know what to do with my hands. I'll just talk like this for the rest of it. Add me on Twitter. At DJ Little Row. And tweet me, and I'll follow you back. Say, hey, I watch your comic book videos. They're pretty cool. You know what it is? Turn up.